Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting right to episode 20 of Hanogato Sky Pretty Care. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Mm. I was about to say, like, yeah, where is everybody else? Want to read more too? More? <laughs> I was like, I'm a learning girl. I gotta know. It's so cute, oh my god. <laughs> we better get our group trip. Well, of course, we have to get the group transformation in this episode because, of course, all four are together. So, hopefully, the cuts are good. The edits are good. Mm, that's all I want. So that when I watch the um, Maho, <laughs> and yes, today, that was supposed to come out today, <laughs> I can talk about it for a couple of minutes. Oh, yeah. You want some tea? Something? Yeah. And besides, having a part-time job is good. <laughs> She kind of gives me Komachi feels without actually being Komachi because she doesn't seem shy. <clears throat>
Oh. Is that supposed to be Home Depot? <laughs> And besides, if you weren't good at this, no one would be encouraging you like this. So, you just try. <laughs> I know, right? But she wants it! <laughs> A peach, <laughs> like, oh, <laughs> a pumpkin, Cinderella, Snow White. <laughs> Sora, once again, being a good girlfriend, being a good wife, oh my god. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, oh. Right. Mm-hmm. She's right. That is a Kaguya in a nutshell. Look at that side eye. Girl, that side eye. Sora. I got an idea. Oh, we still haven't changed the eye catcher. You would think by this week, because the four of them are all together, that they would change the eye catch. Maybe they're waiting until like episode 30 or 25. 
Hey, once you have that spark, you keep going until you're done. <laughs> so of course if she's putting Subasa in it Elle has to be in it it's going to be a picture book about her aww <laughs> done You'll make it. And it makes the most sense for Mashiro to be the one to say it because it's her episode. The, the standing menacingly pose. Now you know, Agatha, it's just outshining all of them right there. <laughs> um, you want me to pose? I will give you a pose. <laughs>
Now, how are you going to stop it? Uh -huh. Not going to work either. Oh, and I want to say this. Why not attack it from behind? One of y'all be a distraction and then boom, but then it might still affect you. Officially, there's your answer. It turns around, gets Sky, and everyone else is still affected by it. <laughs> the fact that he also got him stopping too? What? <laughs> Oh, they go work. <laughs> I still love it. It's so fucking cute, oh my god. <laughs> Did anyone laugh at that last week? Because, I mean, we all thought that it was going to be something gorgeous, but in the end, it still is. It's just cute. Almost there. That's because you stuck. <laughs> mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It's obvious. The fact that he just sat there and just accepted that. <laughs> Did you make it in time? Speaking of which, where is hers?
No, but it's okay. You still did good. <laughs> now, okay, my thing. Now, hopefully this happens in the movie. She can talk to Komachi. Now, because Komachi, and I'm trying to think of anybody else who did books and stuff. The only other one that I can immediately think of as a non-cure is Homegirl from Gold Princess. Now, if she does show up in the movie, then boom, right there. There's a connection so that they can talk and such. But yes, I'm so proud of her. With the amount of time that she had and because of the fact that she wanted to make a learning experience for Elle, it is super sweet. Like, I love, at the end of the day, regardless, they're either doing it for themselves or they're doing it for the love of Elle because precious baby girl Elle. So good. So, 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 so precious. So sweet. Like, oh, I, my, my thing was... At first, when she got the spark of the idea, something kind of told me, yeah, the story was going to be about Elle, but then I kept thinking it was going to be something else. But still, it's sweet because it gave her a learning lesson of you need to share and it's okay to share. Don't always be selfish because, yes, as little kids, we always want to have things for ourselves and we don't want to share with others. And yes, Elle was definitely giving side eye potential moments with that little boy because homegirl was just like mm-mm, 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 no, like, <laughs> I just got this. I am not sharing it with you. <laughs> I'm a little spoiled baby, but it's so cute. This seems more like a Subasa focus episode with still everyone as a whole, maybe. I mean, because of course, it does make you wonder why Macho Grandma is taking them out camping. Because we're now moving into another camping episode, which I'm, I mean, I'm not mad at and such. It's going to be fun regardless. And I do like it when, yes, all of them, including the grandmother, is all spending time together. But it, it does make you question, and I think maybe it's going to do to something with Skyland and how um, they are very close to finishing the heart and making it whole to go and wake up the king and queen. So maybe that could be it because I feel like, as I said, we're getting closer to that. So possibly if 21 is a camp, if 21 is a camping episode, 22 to maybe 25 might be the several Skyland episodes. And then we'll probably see, like, the final Skyland edit, or not really edit, um, story that they have to do, or maybe the second to the last story before we get to the final battle. Because it does make you wonder when we do get to the final battle of this show, are we going half Skyland, half regular world, or half regular world, half Skyland, or is it just going to be a full Skyland battle, or a full, you know, uh, breaking the world battle. There's a lot of things that they could do. Heck, it would even be funny <laughs> going back to Delicious where in that time, when they were traveling all the way to the kingdom, uh, um, was it Hope Kingdom? I think, um, 
No, I'm thinking of Go Princess. I'm not, I'm not Go Princess. Uh, Pretty Care 5. Um, the Kingdom for Delicious. Cook Kingdom. There we go. Um, and they got to see all the other Pretty Cares. It would be really interesting if they wanted to do, like, different moments in time of them going against, like, in different stages of every single Pretty Cares. It would be nice, but I don't think they're going to do that. Because once again, you know, there are, like, in my opinion, as of now, they're kind of really maybe halfway done recording the show and such. Maybe even officially done. Um, so it's just, once again, we have to wait. But, like, the wait is killing me because I want to see how it goes. But at the same time, it's going to be sad because we'll be done with the show. But, I mean, yeah, this was a really interesting episode for Machido. I love the fact that, you know, right there and right then and there for this episode, she truly knows what she wants to do for the rest of her life. And so, once again, when the movie comes out in the next couple of months, I really do hope that these four do get a lot of experience and learning moments from the other girls because it makes the most sense, especially with the fact is that Mashiro is someone who wants to make picture books. Why not ask someone who already is into storytelling and is a writer to help you a little bit more to like just to gain more knowledge in it? There's never nothing wrong to ask someone that. It's always about being in the right moment at the right time. But other than that, guys, that is my action view towards episode 20 of Hit a Goddess Guy Pretty Here. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like or it helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all on Saturday <clears throat> for episode 21. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye.